hi guys welcome back to my channel um, hope you found the previous tutorial helpful um, so today I'm basically going to be focusing on doing a post request using Axios um, uploading an image um, to, to your MongoDB database um, which won't take you a lot of time so let's get into it so basically what we need to get set up, set up for uploading an image um, as well as additional because we're going to be uploading additional information as well to the database so what we need first um, um, is to set up grid affairs storage grid malta um, we also need the path and the crypto dependencies which are provided through the node um, environment so basically you want to then set up um, your grid affairs and your storage engines as well as Malta. Um, so this is basically what you're gonna get if you go into these three documentation sites um, on GitHub. I, I'll provide information below. Um, so basically, this is the setup that you need to get started to uploading images um, to your MongoDB. Um, so this is what I used and this is what worked. I'm sure there's many other resources out there for uploading files to, to your MongoDB. So let's get to the route. So now the post route for uploading the images and additional, um, additional information. So what you need really to get started for Malta to know that you want to upload an image, you need to provide the middleware which is provided by Malta, which is basically this upload.single. And now you provide um, the name of the file input that you, that you put in your front end. Um, so basically what this post request does is, it's going to find the user um, and then set all the form information um, of the event that we're trying to create. Um, and then it's going to run um, events create um, events create and then it's also going to check um, if a file was provided yes or no if not uh, we're just going to return a status of 404 um, you can return something else just depending on what you want so if the event has been created and the photo is available we're going to set the photo id of the event um, to requ uh, request um, the file the file name which gives us the file name of the image that we just uploaded to our mongodb um so this is basically what this route will do for us now let's get back to our form um which is in react um so what i did here i, I used form data to append um all the information that i was getting from the database that I was getting from the form sorry now one of the most important part that you need because usually with with axios you don't need to set up headers unless you really need to but i really needed to do this here for this content type um, and set it to multi-part form data for uh, for this to know that we are handling form data um so i then took my form data um Put it in my in my post requests and also the configuration um, which i needed um, to get this post request with an image so usually with when you don't have images you don't even need to do this form data you don't even need to set the configurations uh headers for this um so i then this was my handle submit for the form um as well as handling all the change from um, from my form inputs but then what I did I also did a different handle file change because I specifically wanted to to get that image from um, from the file from the file form input um, tag so basically what I did was I had to set it independently because I couldn't get it um, using one handle change that I use for the rest of the form inputs that are here on this form. So this is basically what also they changed and made the game different for this to work. So let's test this and see how this goes. Um, so let's get in there. Um, let's 
go create event. Um, I'm gonna create an event. Um, let's say, um, Chris. Uh, let's say hello, Halloween. Oh, that's how you spell Halloween. Uh, I'll throw this party. Yeah, party people. Set the dates. Yeah, they, I don't. We don't have Halloween in this country. Um. So set this set. Um, just general information. This is just to test, guys. Um, this is just to test. So select the image. Um, let me find something interesting. Set that just testing. Um, sure, event, event. Let's add the event, okay? So, boom, that's about it, guys. Um, I hope you found this tutorial really helpful. Um, let me know in the comment section if you need any more help on how to get around this. Um, thank you very much for watching, and please subscribe.